guys. It's me again, Vincent. I am in a wonderful place called Lego. <laughs> it's called Peace of Peace. Welcome to the Peace of Peace, which is in Singapore currently. Uh, it's a UNESCO's World Heritage Art Exhibition where they actually show places of uh, interest being designed and made by Legos. So for people who are crazy to make Legos, and then this is a interesting place where you can actually see how Legos are being distributed and then you can actually look at them so uh, it's actually quite a quite a big place where they actually design uh, locations and places based on on places of of the world like you see places like Thailand you can see places like in Cambodia or maybe you can see places like in I see somewhere in China I'll take some snapshots and show you guys uh, how interesting this place is but I wouldn't be showing you the whole exhibition else you guys won't be coming here so just for your interest this place is about $17 per entry but today is a special offer so uh, during the night festival after 7 o'clock they charge this place for about $10 so if you can come here uh, before after 7 o'clock the entrance fee is going to be $10 only but it's just for a limited time during the night festival so if you guys want to come and visit it's the best time to come during this time so this is part of uh, the exhibition on the second on the first story where you can see actually uh, it's all individual buildings that represents different parts of the world but all in a white concept so later I'll go down and I'll just show you guys how to create the, the, the designs of the Lego are. So this is actually part of the, the area, the Statue of Liberty, if I think I can remember the Statue of Liberty. What's this? It's a very cute, it's a very cute building, what's that? Historical town of, of Guatajato. I think so, I can't really pronounce it. And let's see what's, what's here, this is interesting. This is, this is Sydney. That's Sydney, Sydney Theatre, right? Sydney Theatre, let's see what Sydney Theatre has to say. Sydney, oh no, oh yeah, Sydney Opera House. That's Sydney Opera House. And that's, and that's the, the Pyramids of Giza, I think. Is it? Yeah, Pyramids of Giza. It's quite big though. That's cute because there's this little Lego guy there standing there. Can you see a little Lego guy standing there? So, um, this is the historical part of uh, the exhibition so you can see all the historical buildings oh see there's a leaning, leaning tower of Pisa behind me and let's see let's see what's what's here oh there's Moscow somewhere in Moscow I think so I think this is somewhere in Moscow let's see what's there yeah it's the Kremlin it's the Kremlin Red Square in Moscow and oh this is an interesting building this is the, uh, it's in Turkey. It's a mosque in Turkey. It's what do you call this? The Sultan Ahmed Mosque. If I'm not mistaken, I think they made a similar mosque in Malaysia, which is based on the same concept. So, right here, you can see market based in Birmingham, which is the design, which is like that. And then, what's this? this? Right. Oh, it's, it's the Eiffel Tower. Strange though, I thought the Eiffel Tower was supposed to be in metal. But okay, I'm good. This is where Dubai. Yeah. So it's quite interesting to see all, all this uh, videos. Yeah, I think I think they're showing some some shows over there. But I wouldn't want to disturb the people who are watching halfway. So oh, I'll walk back in front of the the Asia part of the the exhibition where you can actually see uh, uh, Japanese castles like is this Japanese castle over here which is the Ishukushima Shinto Shrine which is in Japan and then you have Taj Mahal the famous I don't know if it's considered as a mosque or it's considered as a temple, but right here you can see um, all the Japanese castles. Let me see what's the name of this one. It's Himiji. If I'm not mistaken, I think it's Himiji. Let's see what's the name of this castle. It's Himiji. It's 
at Himiji Jo. Himiji Jo, I think I have not been to this castle before. What is this beautiful sight? So it's an interesting place. We can actually see all this. Uh, uh, wow, what's this? It's Borobudur. That's in Borobudur. It's in Indonesia. If I'm not mistaken. Oh my God! You gotta see this place. This, this is pretty. This is very pretty. So, sorry. Isn't that pretty? It's such a miniature. It's so cute. I can't believe that this, they have such such interesting designs. And what's this? Piyu city. City of Piyu. It's an ancient city. And then we have... What's, what's here? What's here? We have a complex in Human. Hunaman. Yeah. Look. So that's the, the first story where we have all the interesting places to see. And we went out on the first floor. So this is the first story after uh, after finishing the um, view from on the first story on the second story. So this is the first floor. So coming down here, this is actually the play area where kids can have fun. And then the most interesting thing is all the Singaporean Lego toys. See, this means a lot to people from Singapore though because they represent all of the local items like ERP see that? that's, that's interesting and it's designed by a 11 year old kid it's designed by a 11 year old kid and then look at this this is like a, a bus the bus station and then there's a green bus it's designed by a 9 year old kid and I really love this one look at this it's a Lego, my goodness, it's a, it's a typical Singaporean breakfast where people serve eggs, uh, coffee, and that's like char siu bun. And what, what's here is like a tin, tin of coffee. And then the red, uh, the red cap is actually supposed to be soya sauce. And then the, the blue cap is supposed to represent pepper. So it's so cute. It's designed by a, it's designed by a, a 24 year old guy, but it's interesting, it's cute. Who wouldn't like this, my goodness. These are, this is a typical house in Singapore if you, if you happen to drop by and look at the, the typical chili crab. This is a typical chili crab in Singapore. Ah, look at this. A merlion. Hey, merlion. <laughs> so this is the merlion in Singapore. And oh, these are all the stadiums. And then there's the playgrounds around. So this is the area where you can have fun and make Lego toys. I'll see what's in front of the, the corridor because there's another exhibition in front. I'll bring you guys. So right behind me is the most biggest uh, display, which is the piece of piece uh, art display where you can see all different structures from different countries. I'm trying to figure out, uh, are these items actually from Singapore or is this actually from other parts of the world because it looks very familiar to Singapore though. but I see a pyramid so <laughs> I guess it's not but I do see uh, structures like like look at that that's growing up that's a gardens by the bay and then you see those those are most likely gonna be like uh, HDB flats and I can't really see, okay that's a spaceship and I can't be in Singapore though <laughs> and that's the Pantaleon Okay, that's the pinnacle. That's the pinnacle in in, 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 in Singapore. So I'm not too sure if, if all the designs and white pieces of Lego are supposed to represent different parts of the country or the world. But it's kind of unique to see everything in white because it's very architectural base. Yeah, it's a very pretty place to see. So this is me signing out from uh, Piece of Peace. Went out.